Hey, this is Kelsey from PoofyCheeks.com. Today I'm going to show you how to use the print and cut feature with your Silhouette Cameo. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to go ahead and use a PNG file that I already have of this washer and dryer, and I'm going to make stickers for my planner. So the first thing you need to do is open your file, use the trace feature, select everything, then click outline and trace outer edge. When I drag it away, you can see that red line and that's where the machine's gonna cut. But I need to make these a little smaller because they're not gonna fit in my planner if they're that big. So I resize them and then I wanna do another sticker that says laundry. Um, because it'd be hard to cut out the letters, I'm going to put an offset around it. So let's pick a font. All right, since these letters are kind of small and I'm not gonna wanna cut it all out, I'm gonna put an offset around them so that way the sticker will be a little bit bigger. So go to your offset tool. Now let's change the colors. If we print like this, nothing's gonna show up. Those red lines are cut lines only. Let's set up the registration marks. Um, first, I'm gonna set my page size to eight and a half by 11. I'm gonna be using a piece of shipping label paper for my stickers. Okay, as you see the um, crosshatch lines, my design has to be on the inside of those. Even though you don't see them running down the side, it will not cut. Because I'm using shipping label paper that is two per page, there is a slice down the middle. So I'm gonna put two at the top and two at the bottom and then send to my printer. So I've printed my designs out. I'm gonna line them up on my silhouette mat, load the mat into the machine We don't wanna cut the actual lettering of laundry because as you saw, it was red before and we don't wanna cut that lettering. See how I drug it off? Let me make them clear so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, so if I make this, um, take the color away, you see that red outline? That's where my machine is gonna cut. Before, when I had the actual wording there, it was gonna cut the wording too, but I want one big sticker. So let's click send and you'll see the red line gets darker. That's where my machine is gonna cut around all of those shapes. I have it set up for sticker paper and then click send. So the first thing machine, the machine will do is it will find your registration marks so that it knows exactly where to cut. It scans on the sides and then it'll go up, it'll scan the last registration mark before starting to cut everything. Let's speed this up a little. Okay, it's done cutting. I'm gonna unload it from my machine and now I'm gonna take these stickers and show you exactly how they work. This is just the shipping label paper I use to fill orders. Um, I buy it on Amazon and I'll put a link to it for you. So it cut through both layers, the sticker and the backing, which is completely fine. But look at, peel it off, stick it right on this little card. These are perfect for everybody that does planners or sticker labels. Um, the print and cut you can also use on printable heat transfer vinyl. How cute is that? All right, I think you're ready to try it on your own. So get out your machine and show us what you can make. 